Good evening, Dr. Davis. Uh, Joe, good evening. How are you tonight? Good. Just let me give you a refresher on what's going on. Uh, this is Mr. Tim Miller, 46-year-old male with chest pain. Uh, we've had bilateral blood pressures uh, logged into the electronic medical record along with the 12 lead EKG done at initial onset and 20 minutes later a second 12 lead which is also downloaded into the electronic medical record and ready for your review. Uh, Mr. Miller, good evening. I'm sorry that you're not feeling well but uh, we're here to get you feeling better as soon as we can and I'd like to ask you just a few questions and we're going to work in every way we can to be fast and effective here and then we'll do a brief examination. And Joe, if we could begin at the first heart position, please, at the aortic valve. Mr. Miller, once again, if you could gently let your air out and stop your breathing. That's excellent. Breathe nice and easy, sir. Thank you, Joe. Let's go to our position two. And then if you're comfortable, Joe's going to assist you in sitting up so that we can examine the arteries in your neck and your lungs. Good job. Breathe nice and easy. Thank you, Joe. And if we could proceed to the left side. Thank you. And now, Joe, real quickly, let's drop to the lower lung fields to assess for rest. Mr. Miller, and one more time, sir, on the right side. That's excellent, thank you. Mr. Miller, that finishes up our examination and I'd like to just share with you what our thoughts are. The blood test that Joe just called out does indicate that you're having a heart attack, but your EKG changes are such that uh, this would not be immediately conclusive that you have a heart attack and that's the value of using additional information like these blood tests. Because you are having this heart muscle damage event, we're going to go ahead and uh, prepare the call for a helicopter to transport you um, to a full cardiac center hospital. And <clears throat> importantly, we're going to begin some medication. So let me ask you just a few quick questions about uh, <clears throat> your history to make sure that all of these medicines can be used uh, safely for you. Uh, do you have any history of bleeding? Of